Alright, hello and welcome back to Pokemon Mystery Dungeon. Today we are doing uh, Mount Blaze. So one thing I discovered here, one thing I was wondering, it's like what happens if you activate this part of the game and you're not high enough level? What Rock Path is apparently? Just a short, easier dungeon, this like little four stage thing. And you can just like loop through it, the idea is to, it takes right back here, it doesn't uh, progress anywhere, but there's so much money in the same spot. But um, you can use it to grind essentially is the point. Do I still have my, I sure do. Whoops, wrong button. Oh well. So yeah, hopefully it won't come to that here, like not to spoil things, but there is going to be a boss fight coming up. So that's the deal with Rock Path. I considered just going there to show it off first, but I don't think that should be necessary, hopefully. Oh, perfect. I th also, one other thing I learned, I think gummies help your stats, so I think I should be maybe eating some myself, especially since I'm doing more of the battles that Shikurita is, especially here in a fire type area. But, I mean, you can burn that bridge when we get to it, right? Where'd you come from, Magby? Okay, that might be partially why Chikorita is doing so much more damage than me. <laughs> like, giving them all to Chikorita may have been a mistake here. But it's fine. Alright, Mount Blaze. That, yeah, yes. Oh, I can walk on this, on the red, so that's fun. Chikorita won't be able to follow me properly though, but I guess that's my advantage as a fire type. There's nothing like that for grass types, is there? And like, like water types get the water tiles, fire types I guess get the lava tiles. These are a thing. I don't want an apple. What is this? I do have enough money for that. You know what? And we'll buy that. I remember this being a thing. Actually, what is this and how much is it? Alright. Uh, we'll pass on that for now. But yeah, okay, those are a thing. Um, I remember that. And sometimes, I guess they're just only in later areas, which we have just unlocked now. But yeah. Maybe, how many apples do we have? Maybe, no, we got plenty of apples. That wouldn't have been necessary. Something like, I know you can steal from those shops, but if you do, it causes problems, and I don't know if it would have been wise to try that. Especially, like, given the circumstance, especially. Okay, Chikorita can help me out here. There we go. Mm 
Yeah, I think the I think the wild Pokemon AI just uses random moves constantly, cause like I mean that would make sense, right? Also, this area is gonna be fun to come back to once I'm like high enough level to leave Chikorita alone, because then I'll be able to explore myself, right? There we go. That Chikorita's gonna fall asleep here, that's fine. Another TM for Facade. Yeah. I mean, potentially we would have had to guard Chikorita sleeping, but we didn't. Now, yeah, do you take in the slow route? And this is nothing. I mean, it could potentially be a strategy to like take the special route there occasionally, but yeah, I'm gonna go here. Now we get to watch and hopefully nothing bad happens to me. There we go. Is there an item you can take for that? I'm like, I don't think there, there's nothing obviously for Yawn, but like... There are berries that cure sleep, but you can't really eat them while you're asleep, right? So... Are you just, is there no counter to being asleep in this game? Okay. Okay. And I said before, getting- a, I don't know if you can get partners in here, but it would be cool if we could. Okay. Now we need Chikorita. Chikorita became a whiffer. That's certainly a way to phrase it. I think it just means it's accuracy dropped, right? And it didn't even last that long, so I don't know what was up with that. But... I don't know how um, big this area is. I. I think it has like 12 floors and then maybe an additional three, which is 15 total, but like they're segmented, I think, is the whole idea. Yeah, because we're on 12 now. Uh, do we want to use. Yeah, you look kind of scary, so I'm going to use uh, Peck, which does not do any more damage than Tackle. <laughs> okay, and then you got spooked. Are you going to take poison damage? Like, will you just die eventually? I guess we'll find out. I don't know if that's a question we, we have encountered before, but... Yeah, I wanted you to help with this battle, but that's fine. Oh, right, I can't. Okay, so let's phone front normal. Because that cuts corners, but that's... Oh, okay. Yeah, I can't swap with you immediately. So I guess that was just like a mistake. Oh well. Something to keep in mind for next time, I guess. Because yeah, I didn't... I could only attack it from around the corner with Ember, which obviously isn't going to be very efficient. <clears throat> so we were leaving uh, Chikorita to be attacked 
super effectively, essentially. Right, you are a not ghost type. Okay, this time... We're really not gonna use Roar, so... And then I will eat... I'll eat this one. And hopefully that should bring my stats up. I don't think we'll need a band, especially given how many of them we already have. So that we will just leave. And then I think... Yeah, we got ourselves a little checkpoint here. Uh, if we lose here... You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna do something kinda cheeky here. I'm gonna go ahead and save state. The problem is, because if we lose here because of, like, circumstance... I, um... Oh, okay, they know that gives you the option. Never mind, I should've just saved normal, but it's fine. My thought was like, if we lose because we're too weak, that'll give us the opportunity to turn back. Bullet Seed is really good as a move, isn't it? Also, what did we just- oh, we picked up that. I should eat that, because it's... My type? I hope my stats are increasing because of that. Next time we use a move, maybe we'll see. If anything seems different in terms of damage output. Alright, is that it? Are we... is this? It sure is. Chick, are you asking me the same... asking the same question? Also, we're gonna have a um, boss fight themed as in the previous fight. Well, halt. Why, why would it be yes? I mean, I guess the legend, but you know. Yeah, you're gonna have a bad time here worse than me. I don't... The Warrior of Flame am I? Speak with a funny grammar. Um, are there any good items to use here? Or moves? Okay, what I do... Well, for now, we'll have you... Oh, you learned to wait there. You might change that to get away pretty soon. Oh, okay. Because this does... It doesn't tell you how much each move does. Let's try them all. Scratch does 27. Oh, is that a down animation from pressure? It sure is. The saw does 40... Okay, 21. This is what I'll do. Okay. Oh. Okay, well that's what happens when you lose. What about... Okay. Well, we may as well do this here. Let's reset the clock, but do we need to give Trick Rita a Reviver Seed? Like, why didn't it activate? Also, I think I should, um... 
experiment with this. Uh, hmm. I think facade is ultimately a bit too niche. Also, I think we have a facade TM. We sure do. So, throw the use TM at someone. Oops. Okay. We'll try it out here. 40 damage on not very effective. That's a lot of damage output, so that should help, hopefully. This time I'll just give Chikorita cut right here. I'll give one to Chikorita for the next uh for the boss fight, and we'll see if that helps any. Okay. Okay, that time it only did 23, so why did it... I don't understand, but... Alright, let's try it on you. How much does this do? 29 on not very effective. Oops. Okay, well... One of these, I will uh, I'll eat the red gummy and we'll do this here. This time, uh, we'll throw a rock first, and we'll like we'll let it come to us. Hopefully, Chikorita holding the reviver seed um, helps as well. I might just have to do a bunch of this fight solo if that's going to be a thing. But... We also just might be too weak. If that's the case, we will reload with the in-game save, even though that's not really necessary, and we will uh, we'll do some grinding on the side path. Okay. Okay, but hopefully uh, Shikurita uses one of those moves? Okay. But I'm going to use Hidden Power now. It seems to be a strong move. Never mind. How, how come... Okay. So we'll try one more thing here. I don't think um, Hidden Power is actually that good. Maybe we'll just have Chikorita run away and I'll just do this by myself. Or we'll manage Chikorita's tactics to keep, keep them at a distance. Because, like, they get one shot, and for some reason they can't use Reviver Seed, so they're just getting, like, they're dying immediately, as, as we all saw. And, yeah, if this doesn't work, we will go ahead and... Uh, grind, but hopefully that's not, it doesn't come to that.
There we go. I'll help me, please. Okay, I mean, not really, but... Okay, so this time, uh, Shikrita, we will also- we will still do this. We're also gonna change your tactics to- or should this be it? No, we'll switch to that. I've got enough Reviver Seeds, I can do stuff here. Um, we'll see if this works. Because, I mean, I've got Reviver Seeds, like I said, right? Okay, and then you're gonna hit me again. Alright, well, if there's one. Okay. Now, I think I'm gonna try this as well. Hopefully that, um... Okay, it doesn't really work. I mean, I don't know... Maybe we will just have to... Because if you run, it's... His agility is faster than us, so... Like, this isn't gonna be sustainable for the next. Okay, also, if I go like. This will Chikorita try to snipe Moltres. I wish I could tell Chikri to just like use bullet seed from a reasonable distance. Okay, okay now, um you need to get away. And what I'm gonna do like this, and then you are going to go like this. Okay. Well, now we've got to attack from here. Okay. That was really ugly and bad, but we did make it through. Uh, I'm thinking Moltres is going to be kind of worse than Zapdos because it has a type advantage against Chikorita. Did burn through a bunch of Reviver Seeds, but um, I think we'll stick with this. I mean, there will be another boss fight and another area to grind beforehand, so... We'll uh, go for it here. Don't <laughs> don't back talk it. By flamey chicken, and all right. So then we'll have to do another one of these. Like I said, the other thing too, 
Of course, grinding is more efficient when your opponents are, like, higher level than you, right? So, that's my logic. So, uh, we'll look forward to that. Let's be negative. <laughs> yeah. Sorry to be like that, but... Let's keep moving. Like it, these games are good at setting a nice uh, tone. I right, sure, but so yeah. I don't remember how um, ice type type advantages work. We might have to grind here a bit, but we'll see. Hopefully it's not a thing. There's an Absol. That's ominous. You don't know what that is. Also, why are you saying what's that? Like, that's another person to you, isn't it? Yeah, okay. You are dressing as somebody, you're just using weird terms, I guess. Love your shiny eyes. I get some nice pixel art too, that's fun. And here we are. Okay, so let's check our storage. Do we have any... Not really. The music here is really pretty, and like, I don't know, I'm always, as a Canadian, I'm always a sucker for these kind of like snowy environments, so this is nice. Uh, yeah, so next time we'll go ahead to the next, to the next dungeon. Hopefully the boss fight isn't as bad, like we're not as mired by type advantages, because a lot of the trouble there was that Chikorita couldn't participate in helping us, because they're getting like one-shotted, so hopefully that won't be as much of an issue next time. Although I don't remember exactly how ice-type advantages work, maybe... Maybe that will be a thing. But we'll find that out next time. So for now, we'll call it here. And as always, thank you for watching. Oh, so wait, now hang on. Ice is weak to fi fire, but good against grass, so it might be the same. It might be a repeat. But I mean, that, that's, that's how it goes sometimes, right? <laughs>